Hey everyone, it's Kevin here from Inline4 Gaming. I will be starting a single player, ser player series on the game Played Up with maybe a few guest stars such as Adam from the ETS2 playlist that we are doing. Anyways, let's get started. I will be doing a brand new run through. As you can tell, no profile. We will call this in line four. Okay. Perfect. So let's let's get started. I am show you the tutorial. So this is how you take a fish and you cook it. Pretty straightforward. This is a safety hob right here. So you take the fish, plate it up, put it on the table, cook another fish. Oh, sorry. Once a customer has arrived, take their order, give them the fish. Beauty. Boop, boop. Take the dish. You can also prepare sides, and we're gonna make some chips. Cool. This kind of just gives you a basic idea of how the game is gonna work. We don't just cook fish and chips, we do cook other meals, and boom. Pretty straightforward game, not a whole lot to it, and there we go. Two regular fish. Very straightforward game. Um, yeah, so your aim is to survive as many days as possible. If a single customer's patient runs out, you lose. So, pretty, uh, pretty straightforward game. Not too difficult. Oh, look at his patience running low. Boom. Man, they're just showing different me mechanics of this game. But yeah. Really straightforward game. Anyways, that was just to kind of give you an idea. So let's get started. As you can tell down in the bottom right, I am running this game with 14 mods, I guess the Inline 4 Gaming logo is covering it up. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. We will do, um, you know, I'll let you, I'll just get right into it. So we will do, I like this layout actually, that's not bad. And the only menu we can take from is steak. So we are good to go. I do like myself some steak. Medium rare. So steak, you cook steak once for rare, twice for medium, and three times for shoe leather. Or well done. And recipes can be viewed at any time in the pause menu. So we got that. And because I like steak so much, and I pick on people who like the old shoe leather, so let's... There we go. Shoe Leather Incorporated. Beauty. Alright, let's set up our restaurant the way we want. So let's put a table there. Actually, we'll move these guys over. 
Um, let's do that. So one of the mods I'm using is Pick and Drop. Yeah, I forget the real name for it, but anyways, what it does is it allows you to use your mouse to move stuff around. Like so. I like it. It's very, very easy to use. Uh, not much to worry about. So yeah, here we go. We're all set up. Actually, I might put that right there. Perfect. Ah, that's a good setup. Yes. All right. We are good to go. So let's start with day one. We're going to have about five customers. Group size is one to two people. So we have our tables at two. And yeah, so as you can tell, I can walk through walls. It's called Prep Ghost. It's another mod. Just makes life a lot easier while playing the game when you're setting up automation and such. Um, yeah, so let's get started. If I forget anything, just I'll try and remember it by the end of this video. Let's go. So as you can tell, cooking some steak. Ooh, mess. Look at the mess. Oh, That is very unpleasant. There we go. Made five bucks. I'm just gonna have a sip of coffee. Uh, anyways, so yeah, customers come in, they want to order food, you take their order, you cook the food, and you let them go. And then you wash the dishes afterwards. It's pretty straightforward stuff. I do play this game quite often, but just for you guys, I just started, decided to start off with a brand new profile. Take these plates. Should be one more table. Both well done. Wow. up my mess. Alright. Pretty straightforward. Um, there we go. Alright, so we have made it past day one. 25 bucks for steak, $7 for a player count bonus for a total earnings of $32 in an entire day. That's not a great restaurant. We got a research desk. We are going to save that because this is how you get into automation for this game. Ooh, this is a tough choice. I like the scrubbing brush. All right. So, the scrubbing brush makes cleaning up a little bit easier. And yeah, so we're going to get seven customers today, which is a little bit more. Not too bad. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's do this. Right, scrubbing brush. There's lots of mods out there for this game, too. Um, I just picked a lot of like making it easier. Oh, mistake. Wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> and here is your shoe leather steak. Joy. Oh, nice and fast. All right, please tell me you want a rare steak. Of course not. Of course not. 
medium and a well. Oh, it's a mess. Oh, there you go. Look how fast I'm cleaning these dishes. Oh, two rares. Nice. Let's put this down. I'll show you how slow it is. And then with this. Perfect. All right. Throw down two more rare steaks. Well done. You guys are gross. Enjoy your leather. Perfect. Day two all done. So $35 for stakes and nine player count bonus. 44 bucks. Let's see what we get for cards. Oh, yes. So we are going to do this. Perfect. We could have used the plates, but I am more worried about getting some cards. Um, yeah, I'm trying to... Nope. There we go. Not going to work. I don't like this. Hmm. All right, like that. Let's keep. Um, there. I like to have this space to get out. Perfect. All right, so six customers, day three. And as you can see up in the top there, we are going to be getting a little gift at the end of this day. Maybe something good. Maybe something bad. Probably something bad. <laughs> All right, let's start her up. So what I'm doing here is upgrading this research desk to a copying desk, which is what we want, which is great. All right. Some rare steaks done. Perfect. And of course you want the shoe leather. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. My friends and I would really appreciate that. We will be releasing some more content on Euro Truck Simulator. I know Adam and Corey have some uh, Minecraft in the works, and Evan is doing some high racing. So we got lots of content coming out, something for pretty much everybody, depending on the game. So yeah, I might join in on the Minecraft fun too, I don't know yet. Let's see how this goes first. <laughs> Hurry up. Boom. Perfect. I don't know why I make these rare stakes, I never use them. So after days 3, 6, 9, 12, you get cards to probably make your restaurant a little bit more difficult. Um, so it's, they say it's upgrading your restaurant, but sometimes it's just not fun at all. So we have made 38 bucks. Not bad. Oof. <laughs> All right. So we have steak topping mushroom, which gives us a 15% reduction in people. 
and we have leisurely eating. Now, leisurely eating just, it's not a great card. But I think for our first run through, what we're going to do is stay away from all the sides, all the starters, all the desserts, and just stick with the card that's not them. Which might not be a great run, but we'll try it out. So let's do leisurely eating. My goal is to get to day 15 so we can get to overtime and we can start a franchise. So as you can see here, we got a little bit of everything. Um, we need 120, I believe, yeah, for the copy desk. So we're going to throw out the, le the research desk. And I kind of want to save my money for that copy desk. So I'm not going to buy anything, I don't think. Seven customers, not too bad. All right, let's... Uh, this over. Perfect. Let's get going. Look how long it's taken them to eat. This is why I don't like usually eating. It's a pain in the behind. Ugh. So as you can see, a plate will stop the cooking process, which makes sense. Um, you're kind of dissipating the heat. This is taking forever. Come on. Two mediums. Wow. All right. Take a drink of coffee. All right. Wow. This is not great. <laughs> Rare and immediate. So that is day number four. Ooh, this is nice, but I can't get it yet. Um, I'm gonna buy the plates just for the sake of easy and useful. All right, so we are 42 dollars away from being able to buy that copy desk can't come soon enough all right nine customers let's go Sure, take your time. That's fine. I'm good. No worries. There you go. Enjoy your shoe leather.
probably busy chewing it. And rare to medium. Oh, we're going to get enough to buy that copy desk. Sweet. how messy the dining room is. Wow. <laughs> Alright, so we have 45 for stake and 12 for the player count, which now gives us enough to buy the copy desk. But first of all, these will be our theme. So each restaurant usually has a theme. Fast food, it's brighter colors, it's easy on the eyes, it's quick and easy. Then there's more like fancier um there's which there's like a four different cards there's affordable charming uh exclusive and i forget the last one anyways so we have a choice between affordable and charming um affordable personally i always look at the zero out of nine the top level the top tier for that card i like charming because when you're playing single player like myself having the customers sit at the tables before we get the dishes away is a really nice thing to have so we're gonna go charming and it's a decoration round so get all these decorations oh look at how expensive those are we're gonna buy this all right, let's move this stuff out of the way. We're going to decorate to a little bit. But what we're going to do, that's a lot of fireplaces. Holy smokes. I'm going to the balloons up. We're going to put up a birthday banner because this game is a year old, I believe, or a couple years old now. There we go. And let's take some. Ooh, look at this. Look at this flooring. I like it. Oh, that looks terrible. That's okay. Oh, oh, oh. man. There. Oh. I actually like the yellow. Um, let's put that yellow in there. Oh, yes. That looks absolutely disgusting. And we will take a fireplace. We're going to copy it just for the fun of it. It'll give us more for a possible reroll next day. And uh, yeah, so 10 customers today. We'll be doing a copy. We're going to be serving some steak, probably some shoe leather. And uh, yeah, so let's uh, let's go. close. A medium and a shoe leather. Perfect. mediums. One. 
and two. Well, as you see, we have some customers waiting outside. There we go. Too well done. Enjoy chewing. Medium and a well. Perfect. And what would you like to find, sir? Right on. Never even saw you outside. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. And another rare. Perfect. Finished day six, and now we get a second card. So uh, let's get some money. Perfect. Ooh, photographic memory. Um, this is kind of tricky, especially with steak, because you can order three different kinds of steak. So let's do it. Right on, so let's see what cards we get. Ah, that's unfortunate. I was hoping for a research desk. So let's take these out. Um, let's do a reroll, see what we get. Ooh. This is tricky. I could buy this. And put a rotating grabber in there. Not what we wanted, but we'll take it. Right on. All right, so let's uh, let's do one more day, and then we will call this an episode. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video, so I can create more content in the same kind of genre. Let's go. Hey, customers. Clipboard allows you to upgrade quicker. Enjoy. I don't need you yet. And a medium. So these rotating grabbers are great for automation. Um, we might be able to get into some by, by next episode, episode two. So please stick around for that. It would be greatly appreciated. So two mediums. See, when you walk away, you don't know what they're ordering. Makes it more interesting. Ah. That was close. Didn't realize how messy this floor is. There. And a rare. Perfect. Ooh. 
chewing. I am a rare to medium rare kind of guy. I used to enjoy well done steaks and I got away from that probably about 10 years ago. Um, just not a fan. I mean, medium, perfect. Medium's not too bad either. I find if you're transitioning from being a well done kind of guy to a rare kind of guy, I'd say take it in steps. Uh, try medium well, then medium, or even just go right to medium. It's very good. And that's it. So, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed this content. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring that notification bell for future videos coming out. And you guys all have a good one. I won't look at these cards yet, just for the next episode. Alright, see you guys later.